to you say Don't I see got a show for a minute that they are yeah he does um he his shit's official now why can't I hear him he's voice? official well he, push like, your um headphone in the, or like the plug in there yeah how about now yeah 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 okay, it, it's yeah. in and out so it could be me no um, I, mean, I think it'd be a new set of headphones yeah man hold on let me see if I can this let me do that quick yeah go look that up <laughs> I see Springer Cool, no? no, this is on YouTube, fam. What? Yeah, fam. Look at this shit. Look at this. This shit look fly as fuck. Gee, watch, I, watch Icy stepping it up in life. Yeah. Watch Icy. Kona. Motion, man. Hmm? Yeah, 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 yeah. And watch Gucci, Gucci straight to the views. He has 400 views already. Yeah, yeah, bless. That's blessed, Freddy. Come on now, we need you now. Oh, oh fuck. Okay, audio's recording. Look at it there. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. Yo, yo it's a David Letter, David Iceman show, yo. Yo, I seen this shit and I was just like, yo, this shit is fly. I read fam. it. I read, I read it. it, fam. I'm not, like, I'm not like the rest of these guys out in the city sometimes that'll be like, yo, you know, the person over there is doing that. Da, 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 da. Once I see something dope, good, interesting, I'm gonna give it some love. And so you yeah, sure you're not man. doing the belly thing? Don't like that shit over there. I don't like that. <laughs> I do it on the low. <laughs> Do it on low. I'm not gonna lie. Do it on low, but um, but it's not for content creators. Let me hold on. Let me. Yeah, yeah, it's not for content creators. Yeah, for the content creators, I feel like I'm cool. But maybe for like some of the rappers, them and one two gal them. Yeah, I'd be like, yeah, I'm like, like that. that shit right there. But like, I see what he's doing right now. I like it, fam. It's a different form of content for Toronto. He's doing something like it's interesting how he's bringing his live into like a talk show. Uh -huh. I can't lie, fam. That's dope. <laughs> You know what I'm saying I, I give credit where credit's due. I see said it, he's gonna do it. I just hope it's consistent. Mm -hmm. I don't want to see the next one. What the flying fuck? Anyways, I don't want to see the next one like sorry, Friday. I know you're gonna be swearing in a couple of minutes. I just don't want to see the next one in like two, three months. I want to see the next one within like a couple of days. Oh right. shit, salute to Icy, man. Hello, I salute to <laughs> I'm, I'm waiting too, fam. Now I'm gonna go peep that after yeah. we're done doing this. Holy. Let's clean. Go get some popcorn. Yeah. Watch Icy on the green screen. Come on now. We need you now, Friday. Come on now. Let's see what's we going on We need you now. Here. It's the motion, man. Come on. Let's see. The blackness. The blackness. Keep the keep on. Holy. Holy. This how you're feeling? It's been a long week, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Now that we're all here together, you know what I'm saying? Friday's <laughs> on some different tip versus Marvin Gaye. Yo, fam, I've been trying to get into some inspirational vibes, bro. Yeah, some peaceful. Yeah, because, yo, you got to understand, right? We talk about a lot of fucking negative okay. things that are always going on in the scene out here and shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes you have to talk about some positivity, you understand? <laughs> Trust me, fam. Yo. This is a big tune still. I can't big lie. fucking tune. Bro, every time I watch CP24, fam, it's like, mm -hmm. I get depressed, dog. You know what I'm saying? Can't even watch that. <laughs> fam, every time you turn on Insta, you get depressed, bro. Yo, it's, it's, it's come to the point now, it's like mad carjackings. Yeah. Bear shootings. Like, fam, we're not in Toronto no more. Eh? We're in a little shy town, I feel like. Yeah. Shyronto. 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 Oh, you might got an early title. Only, <laughs> Shyronto. You drilling. Killing. Oh, spilling. man. Spinning. And spinning. Mm. Episode 276. This is the part of the movie when, like, like the bad part happened, everybody gets together. Yeah. We're getting to the climax now. Everybody start working together. <laughs> <laughs> they start building. Like we, have, we haven't seen each other in two weeks. It's like. <laughs> <laughs> People are hugging. Mom's crying. <laughs> Let's go. Your head to the sky. That shit right there makes you 
If you mm-hmm. if you don't feel good when you hear that type of music, you ain't got no soul, fam. I'm sorry. You ain't got no soul in that heart. Yeah, man. So we are buck. It's the world's most smoked out podcast. We love hip hop. I'm your host with the most toast Friday Ricky Tread, aka Optimistic Rick, aka um let me get some AKAs going on here. Um, AKA Sucker Free Rick. AKA um, A Thousand Blunts to the Head. You know, that's, that's still a classic. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Good. And it belongs to me, motherfucker. Y'all know what it is. Um, and bad. that's about it. Um, we got Gutsy Guts in the building. Well, I'll go on, y'all. Okay. We got Gucci Gucci in the building. Gang, gang. We, we over here at the Visionary Arts Center. Two, episode 276, man. Well, no, cool. Now, before we even start. Talk to me. Something happened uh, over here at the Visionary Arts uh, this weekend. Because, mm. you know, I, I put brown guys little... Little, uh, what is it, sticker? Yeah, man. Little brown guy sticker right there because brown guy was here. What was going on over here, buddy? Yeah, man. Big salute to Factor Canada. We had, um, we finally had the workshops or at least the first part of the workshops, um, three classes. Big salute to brown guy made it. TK production. They had one class on videography. Bo Pinto taught a class on um, s- social media management. Mm. <laughs> Friday, like, oh my God. Bro, I didn't know I was supposed to do that with TikTok. <laughs> Yo, um, yeah. So it was, it's def- and I and I taught a class on on how to start a podcast. You know what I'm saying? Nope. So you know, a few people showed up. Not as many people who as the people who as in, who, who enro- enrolled and stuff, but the people who did show up got to get some jewels. You know what I'm saying? We filmed it, so we're gonna be reproducing it. People will be able to catch these courses online and yeah man it's just a beautiful thing to be able to give back yo we ain't just an instagram page people you know we ain't just a youtube page people we do big things out here we're trying to help the city man we try to make this bitch grow yeah man and and yes once again salute to factor canada for you know providing the funds to help bring that together you know what i'm saying and yeah we had events all types of shit going on here yo it's busy yeah we did i love busy podcasting (laughs) you know what i'm saying (laughs) <laughs> you got something on the mind. Shout out the Ganyans. Yeah. So I'm saying Ganyans know how to party. <laughs> Air horns. Okay, I kept asking everybody. So you guys don't listen to no hip hop? No, no, no Toronto artists? No, we don't. It's the chill vibe. We don't need that. Yeah, man. Afrobeats, fam. Afrobeats all night. I finesse. <laughs> That's what sick people did to us. He finessed finesse. us with that one. But yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out to Ganyan. Yeah, man. Um, Gutsy, while, while, while you're talking here, give us your shout outs and all that stuff. Okay, so while I'm doing that, can you build up my thing then? <laughs> 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 Sorry, that blunt is mush up. But yeah, yo, uh, it's your boy Gutsy Guts. Make sure you comment, like, subscribe, do all that social media, YouTube, algorithmic stuff. Six views, uncut episode eighty-seven with uncut, DJ uncut. Las Vegas. So um, mm. you had some quick conversations, good debates. <laughs> Vegas likes to debate with the man them. Oh. <laughs> this guy's the debate king, bro. Yeah. <laughs> and two, he finally found out that liquor is obviously way worse than weed. Okay, <laughs> let's unhatch that. Let's stop for a quick yeah, second. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can. Gucci, mm. liquor or weed? Which one is worse? Like in a scenario, like you get too drunk on a night or getting too, too high, high on a night. Uh, I think I'll get too drunk on a night. So. <laughs> and it's a bad thing. And to you're get gonna too do drunk. something crazy. Yeah. Like you're do something that you're yeah. gonna end up with. Like when you're sober, you're gonna regret, right? Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know why Vegas just feels like he's the only man that don't get drunk in the world, fam. But we had the argument, like, yo, fam, when people get saucy, fam, they tend to do some dumb shit, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And yeah, over the weekend, he had to find out. Maybe like 24, 48 hours after, he had to find out. Like, uh, niggas, yeah. the, niggas shouldn't drink. Not everybody should get saucy. Get a, maybe a shot in you and, you know, feel nice. That should be it. Yeah, because like, okay, what's the worst thing that can happen to you if you smoke way too much weed for the night? The worst? Throw up, maybe. That, 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 I've seen that happen. Pass out. This pa- yeah, more like a pass out. No, I mean like, pa- not like fall asleep, pass out. I'm talking. Like, I've had girls dead weight just on my back. <laughs> I mean, some people get high to the point, like, they're, like, talking. To, I don't know. It's not that <laughs> bad. Being like, stupid it's not, and giggly. Yeah, yeah, it's not that, like, serious. Fam. I mean, some people, like, I don't know still. Some people go crazy Ooh, if they get too high. Like, you know, like, they start, like, 
panicking, like, you know, like people who don't really smoke. Like, paranoid smokers. Paranoid. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> like, I see that happen to a girl. Like, do I look high? Oh my God, do I look high? <laughs> Am I eyes red? Am I eyes red? <laughs> Wait, that, yeah, like, that's once in a, like, I don't know. <clears throat> okay. And, and one more thing before I continue. Worst thing that you ever seen somebody do when they get drunk. Oh, that's bad. A bad, a bad, a bad's car was upside down. <laughs> See, like, <laughs> you, know what I'm you got two turned up before Property you know. Property damage. Yeah, I'm like, yo, I heard a bad's car was upside down. You got the accident and stuff. I'm like, what? This guy, we knew it so was gonna happen because he drank off two sharks. Mm. You know what I mean. Two, uh, two bottle. Of, uh, man, he, at least he's alive. Holy, yeah. you said the car upside down. Yeah, That's madness, bro. fam. You can end up doing wild shit like knocking down your ex girlfriend's door and shit. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. I heard. You know what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> 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 you know what I'm saying. Climbing up the side of the balcony. Yeah, like, getting lost. Stupid o- shit. <laughs> getting lost. OT. You know, just walk in, getting lost. OT. Having your bedrooms look for you. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Way too tired when you're drunk. So. Yeah, I, I don't. Man. I don't advise anybody to to drink and do anything. Yeah. Just go take a shot and just go lay down. <laughs> like, um, you could, bro. dog. You end up throwing up everywhere. I seen girls piss their pants, throwing yeah. up everything. Like I seen girls take a shit, fam. Fam. Like, Yeah, it gets yeah. too like. <laughs> yeah, shits and pisses. Out. Yeah, all of that, fam. Like, yeah, Nobody's ever good. pissed themselves because they smoke too much. Yeah, meat. Like, actually, I don't know. I'd have to. I, I've never met anybody nah. who pissed himself who f- from smoking too much weed. Man, that sounds like a first house. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You'd be like, bro. I smoke too much weed, so I piss my pants, bro. Nah. Like, you can't even inhale secondhand cigarette then, bro. Like, just get out of the your room. Blad- yeah. your, you need to grow up, grow up your blata. Your yeah. blata weed. But um, other than that, mm-hmm. um, yeah, six views uh, okay. uncut. Make sure you guys like, comment, watch the new episode with me in Vegas. Yes, sir. Um, check out the man them. Freestyle slash live performance with Cholo Cash. Yes. Cholo Cash came, yo, Cholo Cash is a goat. Cholo, me and you know why you're a goat. We'll just <laughs> you know, you know. You know, you yeah. know, Cholo is a freaking goat. And yeah, man, just let's just have a great pod. There's probably always like before people that I'm forgetting. Shout out PK. Mm-hmm. Like always. I see PK has an interview coming out soon. Yeah, he's going to be doing an interview with... Uh... Yeah, you see, this is how I know I need to write down this shit because I forgot. Big up... um. Amir with uh, Clubhouse Toronto. Yeah, Amar. Uh, yeah, Amar, yeah. I apologize. Yeah, I went over there to see, um, you know, 416 Media Gang, mm. um, Jess from Team Real Estate, all those people over there. Um, Amar is doing some big things with that Clubhouse Toronto shit and just everything yeah. he's trying to do for the city and, and just everybody in general. So, yeah. Yeah, man. Salute to Clubhouse Toronto. I'm not finding the thing. PK, you know PK ain't gonna post that he shit. He doesn't have to post it on his own page, bro. <laughs> you gotta check his stories, if anything. If it's not in his stories, fam, you're not gonna yeah well PK salute to pk man. herc you know what i'm saying yeah doing this thing out there in the in this toronto yes scene. he has a he has an interview dropping very very soon make sure you guys go like it comment check it out yeah I mean, yeah 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 your thing bubbling now eh yeah yeah instagram yeah. a bubble because <laughs> <laughs> you just see seen that. all the likes pop yeah. up yeah. The likes, <laughs> 100 likes pop up at once yo. oh no yeah man we were going viral over there Gucci, <laughs> what you saying, family? Gang, gang, yo, shout out to the team, man. We stay working, baby. Um, it. Big up to the huh. supporters, man. We love you guys. We see you guys on the comments, everything. You know what I mean, keep huh. showing love, you know? But yeah, man, I'm just here, same old. You know what I mean? Steady in the gym. You know what I mean? Get yeah, you said you had the crazy workout today. Oh, huh. Going upstairs, man. Uh, <laughs> no elevator work is. Mm. <laughs> That's a crazy workout, but not. Five people like emoji at the top. Oh yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, I was at the top. The like... champ is here. <laughs> 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 yeah, our elevator yeah, Marshall. Um, I mean, everybody stay safe. You already know it's your boy Gucci Gang Gang. Hold on, where's sound effect there? Where's sound <laughs> effect no, there? no, 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 huh. no, no, no. Huh. Huh. Because you see, again, like gutsy. I be pre demand them a little bit more. First off, is that the same flavor? No, pause. Is that the banana? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that the yellow fruit? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> That's the yellow fruit. Okay. You know, keeping it vaped up. Se- vaped sec- up. Secondly, so w- how was your weekend? How come I didn't huh. get an inv- invite? Huh. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. So you don't, you want to laugh, but you don't want to talk about it. You, you want to keep it on wraps? <laughs> I mean, I talk about the car show. Oh, this nigga is about to see himself. 
at the same time, yeah, yeah, this nigga, yeah, this nigga yeah. was like, about to get like, oh, like, 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 what, like, what, yeah, um, <laughs> what did I do? Uh, <laughs> which what are you talking about? My bad for that one, Gucci. I'm not even gonna do that. I'd be like, yeah, so the car show, like, you know, why didn't I get an invite? <laughs> Yo, fab. Which is like mm, the car going show. through the memory banks. Mm. Yo, shout out to my my boy T that movie because he hit me up. He's like, "Yo, look out, look outside, fab." I'm like, "What are you talking about?" He's like, "There's a car show going on in by by Square One." I'm like, "Yeah." I'm like, "I lie." So I check. I'm like, "I lie." He's like, "Yo, I'm leaving right now." So I'm like, "All right, yo, I'll, I'll buck you over there." Mm. And my ass decide to say, "Yo, let me take my dog for a walk." You know what I mean? And just bring him mm. over there. Bring her over there. Yo, why did everybody at the car show stop me, bro? Cheese. Like, bro, bro, like, I felt like, <laughs> like, I felt like my dog was Drake or so. Everybody wanted a picture, pet the dog, everything. Like, it was like, what, what's going on? Like, there's other uh, dogs there, bro. Like, Gucci, it was I crazy. It, I thought it was, I thought it was you, fam. Nah, it was even It was me. the dog? It was the dog that was holding man. you getting on the shot. Dior, Dior. Dior, Dior. Bro. Uh, Big up Dior, man. Big up everybody that was at the so car show. Cool. You know I mean? <laughs> There's the sound <laughs> effects for Dior, man. It was this. It was bad lit, though. I thought they were like, yo, that's Gucci. They're like, that's nah, Dior? Yo, Dior took all the shot, bro. Like, Damn. Not a, yo, Dr. took over the car show shine. Like that's how bad it was. Yeah, bro. Bro. I see pe- people taking the dog, <laughs> taking a picture with the dog <laughs> on their car. Like, like, mad fuck, bro. Even Gucci the girl off the frame, looking salty. It's true. So I'm like, yo, what about me? Like, the fuck? Yeah, you don't, don't want to take a picture with me? Yeah, yeah like. Oh, Even a girl that'll get a professional pic. She's like, oh my gosh, can I get that dog in my professional pic? And she posted on Instagram too. Shout you out to Gucci like, photo like, bomb and <laughs> shit. <laughs> don't don't feel no way. I felt that way too. I felt that way this week with, with Cholo. I told Cholo, like, you oh. know, to say something happened, and you know, the person's like, oh my god, Cholo. I'm like, yeah. motherfucker, what about me? I'm yeah. Betsy Guts. Like, what the fuck? You know, yeah, like, nah, 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 don't worry, fam. Your time will come. Like, you know, <laughs> so. Don't worry, man. Yeah, come on. You want to do a call. podcast and shit? Like, hey. <laughs> like, nigga, I got how many episodes of podcasts? Uh, nigga only got a couple fucking music videos. Like, right? what the fuck? Oh, poor guys. <laughs> well, yeah, man. Every, every, everybody's, everybody's good. Everybody's well and dandy. Yeah, yeah. Mental health checks. Everybody's nice. Everybody's... What about you, Friday? You know me? I'm always on the works, fam. Yeah, like... You know what I'm saying? I'm Listen, to be honest, even I'm feeling, I'm feeling good. That's good. You know what I'm saying? Like... I had a few changes that I'm not going to talk about in front of the scenes that I had to do behind the scenes as far as my life. You know what I'm saying? And now I'm, I feel like I'm feeling energized. That's good, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're going crazy on TikTok right now. Like, big, yo, follow our TikTok, fam. Mm. We love Hip Hop Network on TikTok. Same thing. You know what I'm saying? Like, the post, found that little, that little rhythm, you know what I'm saying? So now you're starting to see some some big time 200,000 view Ooh, posts and all type of thing. Cool, no? So oh, you know, I told you we're not just an Instagram five. page, fam. We do everything yeah. on TikTok. Man, we on YouTube. The man didn't say two hundred. He said two hundred. Two hundred. Wow, wow, fam. Twenty k. Yo, fam. There's another post that's up there that's sitting at like sixty k right now. What are we talking about? Let's chill. What are we talking about? Watch Friday. Yeah, easy thing, fam. Soft thing. <laughs> <laughs> ah, it's not easy getting sixty k on TikTok. <laughs> yeah, fam. I seen the fucking followers went from like six hundred to like thirteen hundred in no time. You know what I'm saying? I was like, okay, let's by, go. By the end of the year, what do you think? Set the goal from now. And let's see how it We I'm talking about getting a million views yeah. fucking video. I'm trying to get, yeah. By I'm, the end like, of the year? No, no, like in the end of the month. <laughs> what? Yo, fam, and you can go live on TikTok after you get like a thousand fucking followers, right? So I've been going live over there, like really just trying to turn up the different social media platforms. So, so tap into that. Um, one thing also I wanted to mention here as far as what's going on in the news. You should have read that song. Which one now? Oh, ah, oh, trouble. Let me let me start with it. Let me start with it. Yeah. Let's start it off properly. Um, you know, give him his proper respects. You know what I'm saying? I'm pulling up his profile here. Bring it back right there. Bring it back. Let's get it back. Damn, I wish I could bring it back. Don't remember this? Oh my god! That's how you know I'm a real music guy. Yeah, man. Yo, Atlanta's been going kind of crazy over the last few days. Over the weekend, a um, couple of things happened on the same day. One, um, the person who we were just playing here, Trouble, he was killed. Um, 34 years old. He was killed 
um, while visiting a girl, not his girlfriend, just no, a girl. Yeah, just a girl. Um, it was after a concert that he did over there. He wanted to go chill, get some rest, and do whatever he, you know, had, what he wanted to do. He woke up. Shorty's quote unquote ex boyfriend um, was at the crib and sh- he shot him. You know what I'm saying? There, it was more to it. Like, I, I think it was a domestic thing. So maybe the day before, or I can't remember what they were, the police were About a week saying, before. Or a week before, they were saying, like, um, the girl and the guy were getting into it. Mm-hmm. I guess the situation with the girl was saying, like, yo, he, <clears throat> he wasn't providing for her or whatnot. And then I think somebody said it. You're like, you see a guy in the bed and he's probably a provider. You know, mm-hmm. he's doing mm-hmm. his thing. You know, mental health is a serious thing. And, you know, unfortunately, tr- um, trouble had to, his, his life had to get lost in that unfortunate fucking domestic uh, dispute. Yeah, because they said that um, his car was outside of the place. Homeboy seen the car. Mm. It was a luxury car that was in, like, I guess, a kind of a hood area where Shorty lived. And she's, and it was supposed to be her ex. But, you know, man, them having the keys. It's probably together with her for mad years. Yeah. So it's like, ex man, how long? Man, I don't mean? even need the keys, though, fam. Man, them kick down doors, open up windows, kick down windows. All that. They, don't, they don't even that's need that. Mod. And that's even mod. So too. he had the keys? I don't know. They don't know, but they're yeah. just saying like he could have had the keys and just pulled up. Yeah, yeah. And um, I'm gonna also tie in another thing that that went on, but I want to bring it back to the trouble story. Metro Boomin's mom also got killed by her husband, and then he killed himself. Apparently. And he killed himself afterwards. Mud. You know what I'm saying? So this all happened like I think in the same night or like within the within a 48 hour span. That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? That's crazy. So R.I.P. to Metro Boomin's mom. Um, trouble. R.I.P. Yeah. to trouble. R. R. Condolences to both of their families. What I want to ask y'all, right? <clears throat> um, you ever get caught up going to visit a girl? Like I've never got caught up, but it could have happened many, many times. When I think about it, like afterwards, because I was young and dumb, like I, I wasn't really in the, I wasn't in the streets at all. I was just like this young fucking nigga that just wanted to fuck down the place. Mm-hmm. So like I'm going to Regent, I'm going wow. to fucking. Jane and Finch, I'm going to Palisades. I'm just going to the hottest of hot ends until I can't remember what happened. I think it's when I started realizing like niggas were actually <laughs> shooting people down here. Oh, yeah. mm. And I started like paying attention to it. And my bedrooms were explaining to me, okay, this place has beef at this place. And, da, 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 da. and I was like, maybe it's not a good idea to go to the girls. And maybe it's a better idea to have the girls come to me. Maybe. Yeah. Keep going so, though. But, but that's another thing too. You got to watch the girls that you're talking yeah. to. Because then if you have a little bit of money, you don't even have to have money. If girls just think that you're a good setup thing, all right, well, he lives here. He does this. He works here. He does that. Or you broke her heart. Yeah, you broke her heart. You just become a lick anyways, right? So. Yeah. Yeah, because like you could, she can, you can bring her to your crib. That's maybe fine until like you and her don't agree no more. Yeah. And then next thing you know, she's like, I know where that pussy nigga lives. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? No, it could always be. I think that's a very tricky situation with. But the trouble situation, more than anything, is just tricky to know mm-hmm. what the situation was between her and um, set gentleman there. Because was it her ex? For how long? She's saying it's one thing, the de- domestic dispute. Like, I'm just thinking it's crazy. Like, he was beating her up. Why did he shoot trouble and not shoot her kind of thing? Well, I'm not, I'm not wishing on her or anything. I'm just trying to, like... Okay, even with the domestic dib- dispute and all that, does it even matter, like, the prior history? They could have no history of yeah. like him beating her up or whatever. And in that moment that he walks in, yeah, right. sees homies laying up in the bed. That's all it takes. Now he's violent. He could have not even been a violent person. Yeah, no, you're right. You're you know right. what I'm saying? I want, you know, I've done time with guys who, old men. You know what I'm saying? It's usually the old men. Old Trini men. Or, no, no. Old, like, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm, just, I'm just joking. I'm them too, joking. though. <laughs> them too, though. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> them too. But oh, I bumped into some old white men that were, they were in there because they killed their wife in what they call crime of passion mm. you know what i'm saying That's you walk in your wife's in bed with another man you you black out yeah you kill everybody in the room right you get a lesser charge than a full first degree murder because it's a because of wife. the blackout yeah, effect yeah. and shit you know what i'm it saying it drives you crazy still exactly just, you, you had temporary insanity yeah it just that's not what are you doing like that's nuts but you're so, okay matter. actually no before that Gucci, give me one scenario. I know you, as a, as a gal, as you've yeah. gone to put somewhere and you're like, why the yeah. fuck did I honestly, come here? Yeah, honestly, anytime like I went to go check a gal, 
like in the hood, mm. I always bring my bread and stuff. So there's a time that I went to go <laughs> check my bread, a girl, you know what I mean? But I said, yo, Bob, because it's like, I think it was Jaden Shepard or something or something like wow. that. And I, he said to Fog, because I'm like, yo, I'm going to set up a bread and for you, you know what I mean? With my shotty. So as we pulled up in the parking lot, bro. Why is there a bunch of mans bunning it down, man? <laughs> I'm like, yo, fam, I'm not even coming out my car still. You know what I'm trying to say? Mm-hmm. Like, because we have to pass them to go to the yacht. Like, you know what I mean? So I'm not even like, I'm not even taking that. And she's like, I called. I'm like, yo, I'm out here. She's like, all right, come to the. I'm like, nah, nah, like there's mans out here. And then she's like, all right, all right. Um, she's going to end up coming out. But she was taking so long, bro. I'm like, yo, my mm. nigga's like, yo, we should just skirt because I don't know, fam. But I'm like, I know this girl, like, you know? So, I mean. Do you? I sort of, like, you know what I mean? Mm. Like, I didn't want to kill, but I don't know her, know her like that. Yeah, you know I'm trying to say. So, nothing happened, but I was just cautious. I'm more cautious, like, you know, you I'm not going to, yeah, I don't even, I didn't really stay there for long. And she came and checked me, and then she's like, you're not going to come? I'm like, nah, like, we're just. We're just like, nah, we're just talk to you for a bit. We're off of this. So we got to make a couple of moves. We just pretend like we got, you know, a couple of things to do. Mm. Just come to say or whatever. I was just more like, yeah. Nah. But but that's another thing that doesn't get <laughs> spoken up a lot. Like, this is why females need to talk up when they're in abusive relationships, fam. Mm-hmm. Because you're not just hurting yourself. You're yeah. damaging other people, too, because you yeah. want to move on. But you can't fully move on because you have a crazy motherfucker. Yeah. And you ain't even letting a guy know that, hey, well, you know. My ex or the guy that I'm talking to, you it's know, it, it, it's, it's a little bit tricky. This and that mm-hmm. and the third. Like, like these conversations need to be had. Or because, even a yeah, stalker like, that used to like her a lot. Like, it could be one of those yeah, guys, that, yeah. guys that's parting and like, oh, that's Shati's checking that. you. Oh, and he's passing me right now. That's his whip. Like, yo, I'm going to wait till he leaves out. You know, like, yeah. you know, like, mm. like, you know, like, I'm not going to tell her, walk me back. What's she going to do? Like, stop, stop, stop. He's, you know, like. Not even that shirt <laughs> man. Shirt man's pre the time. Yeah. <laughs> so, oh, he pulled up at this time. Or That's this is that the third. Yeah. So I'm going to come back at the same time. A little bit before. Mm-hmm. See if he comes true. Like, niggas are great. Yeah, dude. Fam, look what happened to me just now. Yo, that was you in the whip. Yeah. Da, 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 da. Man, mm. I was like, man, him call me. Like, yo, that was you. And I was like, they prayed you. I'm like, what whip? Uh, I was like, maybe. <laughs> it they, was like, they prayed you. Yeah. They pre- slang. And two, pre- it, it was P-R-E. funny too. <laughs> <laughs> Don't kill me. But it's funny too because I didn't, it was until like we were on the highway till he called me. So mm. this is maybe like five, 10 minutes after. He's just like, I, oh, I just don't want to let you know I seen you. Yeah. He didn't even let me know right away. He's just like, all right, let me go do a one-two and then let God know, like, yo, I seen you. So, yeah, yeah you got you to, gotta, just in general, I think in life, it doesn't matter who you are, what you are. Just like Friday was saying, you could be a, a, a random white person. This could have happened to anybody, bro. Yeah. I don't think it's a... And it, it, you don't even have to be checking the girl. Sometimes it, it's set up different, like RIP to Houdini. Like, mm-hmm. I swear he was checking a girl and he was leaving and, you know, it happened. Like, yeah. fans are waiting. I think he was trying to get weed, though. I think that was... Oh, was it a gal it thing? I thought it was a gal thing. No, no, he, 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 I think it was that, but he went to go get weed and some shit like that. Oh, okay, okay, okay. But, but, he, but like, that scenario is so common because also, even with the scenario that we're talking about with like going to these different people's hoods, it's, it mostly happens in people's hoods because a lot of people are outside the building yeah. or hanging around. You don't know out of like, let's say the group of five, <laughs> which one of them niggas smashed her. Yeah. Right? And like, maybe not like smashed her and like had a relationship with her, but they really fucking like, like her, yeah. man. They never really told the rest of the man them because in the hood she's kind of a slew, mm-hmm. but like a slew. Sorry for the for the people. <laughs> she's a, she's a hoe, right? She's a but <laughs> he really he likes, likes her. her. Yeah. He has feelings for her. Yeah. So now he sees you pulling up in your whip, yeah. and he's like, "This motherfucker, yeah. man." And I had a nice whip too at the time, so I'm in mm. the Jada shop. That's why I was so cautious. I'm like, yo. I kind of have my bracelet on my ring. I'm like, I'm going to walk. Oh, you were, you were to, flexing. I have to walk, on top of that. Yeah, I have to walk past these guys, fam. Just for, nah. I no, but know, Gutsy. Like, that's a no. <laughs> he has to flex. <laughs> yeah. Because you're going to check a girl, yeah. fam. So you're going to look at, you're trying to go look your nicest on top of it to go see the gal, score some pum pum. Yes. I'm a you're different You're not going to go like, dress down. And yo, you know what's funny too? A man got slapped up that same night <laughs> at the same place. See what I'm Jay talking Jeff. about? I'll give you one scenario. There's a barbecue down the um street, mm-hmm. or like you by know, the clo- park. yeah, close I know by. Exactly. The, I was like, what the? 
I'm like, yo. And then my brethren, like, see, good thing we are, like, our clash is not to, you know, like. Your instincts, bro. Yeah, or it's like, Spucking yo, instincts, just man. that, bro. Just leave. Just tell the shot to you. We're going to deal with something. So. I had one scenario back, um, like, early 2000s out here, right? I went to go check a girl um, that I bumped, I met on Young Street doing my hustle. And she lived over by Weston and um, Jane. You know where the near that 7-Eleven is? That mm -hmm. popular 7-Eleven mm -hmm. over there at that corner. So I'm there standing at that 7-Eleven waiting for her to, to, to come meet me. All right? She meets me, her and one of her homegirls. And then we walk back just a couple of blocks over to the house where I guess she's hanging. It's not her crib. Mm -hmm. Right? Because there's bare mans in front of the house. Like four or five mans just standing outside the house just chilling. And I walk past them. I, I just... You know, just just put your head down and just fucking do it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I walked past them. We were walking on. Uh, walked in with the girl, uh, with the girls. First thing that I did, instinctually, while I'm up there rolling up with the girls and just chilling, mm. I took a couple of the dime bags that I had because at the time I was selling weed, yeah. right? And I, I was like, yo, man, them. I, I stuck my head out the window. Yo, man, them. Walk on. They're like, yo, what up? I dashed like two, three dime bags down there. Yeah. Ah, oh, when they seen the weed. Ah, oh, oh, respect, okay, respect. Okay. And then I went back in the crib and just fucking just chilled. I didn't smash there in the crib. I ended up taking so the girl back. So you paid homage to them. Like, I paid homage paid, and then I just, all right, like, you got just went back and relaxed. <laughs> paid right? the safety tax. That's what, that's what those guys love. Bro. Nobody yeah. asked me. You know what I'm saying? Nobody was like, yo, you got something. I was just like, let me just yeah. Make sure everybody's cool outside yeah. and then just go back to what I'm doing. In but that could have went left too. Yep. Because then you have some some people would have looking like, oh, this nigga trying to show off. Like he yeah, has yeah. it. Got it eh? All right, he has it. Let's yeah. go take it then. Yeah. Let's what go else take you got, it from Yeah, what else you got? <laughs> Give me that stack that you got with that. You know what I'm saying? Like yeah. it could go both ways. And yes. too, like it's tricky because some girls really don't know, fam. They don't. Some girls be so fucking naive to the fact like, yo, like, this person's here. Like, you know, he's here. Friday's here. Guts is here. Just come. Just roll. And they don't be knowing like, yo, I might have issues with somebody or like, like Yeah, that. he's coming now. Yeah. All so right. it's like, like they be so naive to like even thinking anything happens because niggas just come and fuck them and mm. they ain't doing anything crazy around them. Like, but then when they see another person is around that they might not like or they might think as is a lick or whatever, it just becomes a totally different situation, fam. So yeah, yeah, just to everybody be careful out there, man. Yeah, that's true. Stuff. Yeah, man, keep your head on a swivel, yo, straight up, fam. And R.I.P. to to um to puzzle trouble trouble right and Metro Boomin's mom. You know what I'm saying? I I should have pulled up her name um with all due respect, but yeah, man, just crazy things going on. And as far as back over here, um, just to get into a quick story before we get to our music, carjackings. Oof. There was something called Project Zigzag. Zigzag. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why they called it Project Zigzag, but it, they said they used it to um, try to bring down some of the carjacking that's been going on, especially in Scarborough. They said Scarborough is the, actually the craziest where it's been going down. I it was Brapton. Yeah. Well, that's the thing. This, this story I that I have here, too. they found two teens who are facing 17, oh, sorry, 100 charges, 17 and 19, these guys are, right? And they picked them up because they were driving one of their stolen cars in Brampton. Wow. You know what I'm saying? But they're all part of this. They picked them up part of Project Zigzag. So they're starting to crack down on the carjacking. It's a lot of yeah there's a lot of young people doing that because they're looking at it like that's an easy lick, lick. you know what i'm trying to say like mm -hmm. i don't know but they have to use to open up your car but uh, they see no no that. no that's car theft carjacking is you're driving somebody fucking you're stop at a light and somebody runs up, up and says up, get out get the out fucking the car. car okay or drags your ass out the goddamn car into the in the middle of the intersection and then jumps in the car and pulls off which is also easy to do as well. Yes. <laughs> That's a really, yo, see, times are hard, fam. Like, but I mean. Thank you. Damn, bro. Like, that's what's going on now. Like, people are really yes. going ham. This is, and this is on a rise. This is not like just a once people in a while that's happening. right now. This wow. is happening like every other day in Toronto right now. Every, what? Yes. Yeah, fam. Well, you got to look at it. Nobody's working. Mm-hmm. Nobody wants to work. Because of vaccine, people, they don't want to, there are some people. Some people, yeah, they, you might need va vaccination. There's just so many, like, ins and outs of getting a, a regular job now. Is that it, it becomes harder, right? Yep. Oh, yeah. So then you have you have that. You have the mental health issue. Mm -hmm. You have the CERB. Then you have the 
you have people hearing that they're coming for the people them for the serve. Mm. Like there's just a, a buildup of shit, you know. Everything is gone up. What is it? The 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 inflammation yeah. and all that stuff, fam. Yeah. They just gotta eat, bro. Oh. So like no. I don't I guess Sorry. I'm not encouraging inflation. It. Inflation. That's Sorry, inflammation. Inflammation. That's inflammation. That's, that's, Sorry. Uh, that's something you gotta check with the doctor. Is, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a doctor. <laughs> inflation. I swear milk is like seven bucks now. Man. Yeah, it's a mod thing, fam. Yeah, like for like the box milk now, yeah, not even yeah. the two or three bags. Yo, what's going on, fam? But no. They know the government. They all know what's going on. They obviously they're trying to make the rich richer and the poor poor. They're trying to slap on the middle class. So mm-hmm. they're seeing what's going on, right? Raising the price for everything, and they they know this is gonna happen, bro. Like the people can't work because they don't have the vaccine. They know what's going on, Yo, man. I see somebody said. I know. Yeah, we gotta go get a lighter. Yeah. Oh man. Ooh. Yeah. I see somebody say something about um they're gonna get the serve. They've been getting back the serve money in the gas prices. Because mm, gas is like two dollars and ten cents. Gas now. don't even make sense, bro. Gas is retarded. So the amount that they're charging you in gas is probably what they're just taking back for fucking serve. All right, you guys don't want to pay back your serve here. We're just gonna jack up everything, and then everybody has to pay it. Yeah. Everybody's paying it back. Wonder why people are all stealing gas now. That's what I'm here. Mm-hmm. Well, fuck, bro. If you can't afford two dollars and ten cents, fam, that's crazy, fam. You can't fill up to fill up your gas tank. Yeah. It's costing like two bills, fam. Yes, yeah, minus right now, bro. Right? So even the niggas who are carjacking, they ain't even getting that far because after a while the thing run out yeah. of gas. Just leave that, bro. Take that apart, fam. You gotta yeah. bust, down, bust down that car like it's a fucking watch. You better make it to the chop shop. And ho- yeah, hopefully right. you jack yeah. somebody who ain't on E, fam. Yeah, everybody's true. probably on E. No, nah, yeah. but there's, there's spots. There's Scarborough, West End. There's, there, there's the little shop that you can be. <laughs> you no, no, but you can not get what I'm saying. You carjack a nigga. And you carjack a nigga whose tank is like right on the last yeah. little bit, fam. You can't even get to like, you yeah. can't even peel off, bro. You're peeling off and next thing you know. <laughs> yeah, I'd be cheese. Dude. Gonna, <laughs> it's fine. You got you to you you uh, carjack electric car. Yeah. yeah, bro. Like, fam, times are so hard. You might rob somebody whose just car is just not even. He be, be gas, worse bro. than you. He just be driving. Yeah. <laughs> That's. You be hey, hard times is everywhere, fam. Yeah. Didn't they didn't they just bump up to two two dollars like the other day? Like no, wow. no, it's like two oh eight right now, fam. Damn, bro. I'm gonna be three dollars by the end of the year. Yeah, bro. You th- nah, that's way. That's too crazy. That's crazy. Listen, the price of that right now is crazy. So <laughs> yeah, I know it's crazy now, but that's like bananas, fam. Like yeah. Three dollars. A lot of shit going on, fam. Um. But yeah, man, I just I just wanted to bring that up just as far as some like things that are going on over here locally. It's been a, it's been a mod mod thing going on in the city. You're not gonna talk about Bo- Boji and, and fucking thing. Uh, what Boji and um Mustafa and yeah, Mustafa? <laughs> oh man, I feel like we beat that to yeah. death over on your show. <laughs> yeah, I yeah, fucking they, did they a... kept going, fam. The man went to the gym after. I don't think I we seen, seen that, that part. <laughs> I seen him running up the stairs. I, I actually added that clip of him running up the stairs to y'all after. after. Yeah, even if it happened after, but I did a live. Yeah, talked about it for like half an hour like what these motherfuckers need to do mm-hmm. you guys need to just work it out fam yeah work but, it out but a lot of people were hating well not a lot of people people one two were hating on the fact that people were encouraging them to go fight but i don't see what what's wrong with that i would yo it's not like these niggas are like yo we're smoking on your dead ops or this and then the third it's a straight yo let's see each other we give you we give somebody gets a fade and that's it Okay. I, I don't see what's wrong with that, bro. Like we're that's what's missing in this fucking era, bro. Yeah, but it's not gonna happen. And I I, I don't think it'll reason, happen on camera. The reason I've been like trying to stay away from it, because I feel like I'm I feel like I'm starting to sound like a Moji hater. Yeah. And I'm really not, fam. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But like he's just giving us so much material where I'm just like, I can be like, I'm cool with it and it's entertaining. Don't get me wrong. I'm yeah. fucking entertained. Yeah, hell yeah, I am. But he's clout chasing like a motherfucker. The nigga said what he had to say to him. Said, yo, you can pull up on me. We can handle it. He said that shit in private. Yeah. This motherfucker turned it into mad content, which is cool for us because we're we're entertained. But in real life, like, fam, you're just clout chasing now, bro. You know what I'm saying? Like, them niggas have real issues with each other. And this nigga's using it as content now, bro. Rap Boy said if... um. If Mustafa the poet beats Moji, we have to call that poetic justice. <laughs> <laughs> if you guys don't joke, it's just funny. But yeah. yeah. Yo, listen, I'm I'm entertained, bro. <clears throat> I'm highly entertained. I wouldn't mind seeing them again. 
because they know each other and mm. I think it's personal, I think that's why they need the fade. And the fade might be able to happen, just not on camera. I, yeah, I don't think it should be a public spectacle. Yeah, I don't think it should be a public thing. But I do feel like maybe parties need to come together. Yo, if we can, if it's not a fade, a conversation, something does need to happen where these guys do need to talk. Because yeah. like in general, like, yeah, we do need to make region great again. Like region is like a, a, a huge part of Toronto culture, fam. Regardless if you guys don't like region or not, these guys, like, they started a real big movement, fam. They so did, like, fam. And you know, the see, only thing I want to see is a picture of them two together. Yeah, that'd be dope. That's it. I don't want to know what happened in between for them to get there. Maybe they could explain it in an interview if that happens. Yeah. But like, just show us, okay, we're fucking squashed this shit, man. We're good now. You know what I'm saying? Like, come on, guys. The way how they're so, the way how Mochi's so angry, I don't think that's going to happen. <laughs> but that, there's, there's nothing that can't be fixed, fam. And, uh, despicable. Yeah, like. It's despicable. <laughs> despicable kids like we could bring up some shit right um and yeah we'll do the top six when our guest gets here we could bring up some shit right because he's had his face fucked up before this is what's making me sound like a moji hater mm -hmm. right he's had his face fucked up before so in the end of the day it could go all the way to there and it's like fuck what now you know what i'm saying come on bro like i see what you're saying but i still think for somebody that's able to get their face fucked up and still come on camera, that, that, that says a lot, fam. Because a lot of people are able to just, yo, yeah, this happened to me and whatever. So yeah. I think that's why he's even pushing this narrative too. Because it's like, yo, fam, I want to defend it. Yeah. So I, I, I see what you're saying too. But I just think they need the fade, fam. I think that more, I think we need to encourage the fade more where these niggas need to go and fight. Mm -hmm. Just like you said with um, my boy there. China Mac and China Mac and AD. You have the fight. Whoever won, won. We keep it. We don't talk about it. But I think more of that needs to happen in the yeah. industry, bro. Because yeah. too much times it's like, it gets to a point where it's like, yo, I want to kill you over something that's nothing. And I'm not saying this, but we've seen so many times where somebody would say something so stupid. And then like, look how much time Safari gets beat up. And like, you yeah. know what I'm saying? It doesn't need to be that. Like people just need to, yo, come. I have a problem with you. I have a, okay, let, let's, does it need to be to a point where we have a fade? And then squash it, whatever. Yeah. I think that needs to happen instead of, yo, I'm just going to shoot you, fam, because I didn't like what you said or you did something or when yeah. I see you. It doesn't need to be. It's not that serious, fam. It's not and, entertainment, and it, bro. And it goes there so easily, so, All fam. the time. And part of the reason I feel like it goes there is because the public part about, about it. You know what I'm saying? It's cool to a certain point or like it's an issue to a certain point until everybody publicly starts knowing about it. And then as people start chiming in in the comments, the then it becomes embarrassing. Space. Exactly. It becomes embarrassing. So now you're defending not just the infraction, you're on, on top of that dealing with the embarrassment that you have to deal with the public shit. Yeah, I know you're right. So it's like, fuck, man. You know what I'm saying? Like the internet could, we've spoken about this. The internet can trick you out your fucking spot, bro. It can yeah. trick you out your position. You know what I'm saying? Niggas are jumping in the comments like, yeah, emoji, get him. And then these niggas are fucking uh, just, be like, fuck it, I'm pissed today, man. Like, fuck this guy. And then do something stupid, bro. Facts. You know what I'm saying? Then we're fucking 10 steps back again, right? Yep. <laughs> Come on, man. Um, let's take a quick break um, because our guest is like just a few minutes away. We'll do the top six with our guest and, and get into our interview. Mm. And, and uh, we'll keep that a secret for the, for the YouTube audience. Run the, run, mm. run the trouble. Run the trouble. You can run the Drake part. Yeah, man. And, and RIP the trouble, man. If you like this video or any other videos like this, there's more that you can choose from. Make sure you like, comment, and share these videos. And make sure you subscribe right now.